Hi, my name is Steve Lariccia and I'd like to welcome you to the New Zone Gallery. We're located at 110 East 11th on the corner of East 11th and Oak. We're also open up every day from noon to 6. So please definitely come on out. During the month of April, we have our featured artist will be Nancy Friedman and our spotlight artist will be Sherry Smith. However, in the Klaus Meyer room, we have a special exhibit of artwork called the Collected Nude Zone. This is a collection of my, uh, that I've collected over the past 30 years from past Salon de Refuse shows, New Zone shows, Zone for All shows, and other outside New Zone shows that we've done. The collection has uh, black and white and color photography, oil, acrylic, bronzes, even paint by numbers and many others by artists by Barry Geller, Jerry Ross, even my father, myself, Barbara Baklarova, Chris Johnson, and Dimitri Callums, among many others. The show will run to the end of April, and so if you have a chance, please come on out. The piece that we have in the show is a piece by Barry Geller, Waiting for Spring. This was exhibited in the 2003 Salon de Refuse, and we used it in the 2004 Salon poster. Barry Gallo was an uh, artist for Playboy during the 60s, and he has recently passed away some years ago. Another favorite piece of the show is by Aaron Williams, Softening the Spring. This is an acrylic uh, that was exhibited in the 2005 Salon de Refuse, and we used it in the 2006 Salon de Refuse poster. There are two versions of the poster. One had uh, the image as you see, and the other had refused letters over strategic parts of the uh, image. And we found when we passed out the posters that it was equal. Someone liked the refused version and some liked the, this version. So uh, there was even a third version uh, that was the takeoff of the Mayor's Art Show poster. Uh, the the uh, poster had a, uh, a uh, clothing pattern was actually the, uh, uh, the poster for that year. And my daughter happened to notice that, oh, they have her dress on there. And I actually, actually cut the dress out from the poster and it fit perfectly on here. So there's actually three, three versions of this poster. Other pieces in the collection include a self-portrait of Barbara Baklarova. We have Sarah Whitworth. Uh, it was a piece uh, that was submitted to the A3 uh, intern show that we have. Quite an interesting story about this work, and we'll get into it. Uh, I have an original Polaroid manipulation, uh, nude with hats, and behind me is uh, Anna Muller, and this is a cast paper. Framing. We also have a clay uh, African torso uh, by Dick Gray Lynn, uh, a piece from an etching from Joseph Lieberman, one of our past New Zone members. And another past New Zone member, Jamie Barris, a uh, mixed media with wood and uh, Scopey, uh, that was purchased uh, about 18 years ago now. Also, we have a study of the inside out by Jamie Barris right here. We also have a plaster torso by another piece by Anna Mola. Over here, we have a Dennis Duvall, uh, another male nude with a female nude. And also a couple of paint by numbers that my dad did during the 1950s when he was stationed in the Coast Guard. One interesting fact about the show. The original title of the show was going to be just the collected nude. And a week before I set the show up, I thought, oh, maybe she just changed the name because of my license plate. So when I got my license plate for my car several years ago, I couldn't do the N-E-W-Z-O-N-E, -E, too many letters, so I did the phonetic new zone. Well, it wasn't until about a year or so later, a, a French couple came up to me and they said, where's the nude zone at? I go, what are you talking about? Well, your license plate, it says nude zone. I'm going, what do you mean? Well, that's nude zone in French. Zone is zone is French, it sounds like French, and N-U is nude, and I never knew that. So, right before I put the show up, I changed the name from the Collected Nude to the Collected Nude Zone. 